Let's go on a field trip with Katie's Classroom. Hi, friends. Can you guess where I'm going today? I have a backpack and a lunch bag. I'm going to school. Have you had your first day of school yet? Well, today, I'm going to show you what your first day of school might be like. You can come along with me and we'll learn all about it. So here are a few things that I know about school. School usually starts after breakfast and it ends before dinner. And during that time in between, we go to school to learn and practice skills that'll help us as we get older. And there's a couple different ways that you can get to school. You might drive in a car with a grown up, or take a school bus, or maybe your school is close enough that you can walk or ride your bike. Every school is a little bit different, but there are a few things that are the same. Every school has a classroom and a teacher, and of course, there are students. Other kids your age that might be going to school for the first time too. Another thing that's the same at every school is our parents don't come with us. We say a big goodbye before school with lots of hugs, and at the end of the day, we can say a big hello with new stories to share. And I know saying goodbye sometimes might feel really hard. I know I sometimes get a feeling like butterflies in my tummy when I have to do it. Do you ever feel that way? Well, it's a very normal feeling to have. And I found something that helps a little bit. I like to carry something in my backpack that reminds me of home. I'll show you. <laughs> Let's see. Ah, this is a picture of my cat. <laughs> She's at home, and whenever I feel the butterflies, I just look at the picture and I take a deep breath. <sighs> and I remember, soon I'll be home too. And that makes me feel a little better. You might like to carry something in your backpack that reminds you of home. Oh, that means school's about to start. We should find our classroom. Are you ready? I'm feeling ready. Let's go. This is our classroom. If you're not sure where to find your classroom at your school, you can always ask a teacher and they'll be able to show you where it is. Let's go say hello. Hello? Hello. Welcome Hi. to our kindergarten classroom. <laughs> I'll be your teacher, Mrs. Tripp. Hi, Mrs. Tripp. I'm Katie, and these are my classroom friends. Hi, classroom friends. <laughs> and hi, Katie. How are you feeling today? I'm feeling good. Well, if you need anything, you just let me know, okay? Okay. Let's introduce you to the class. Yes, please. Hands on top, let everybody stop. stop. Thanks, friends. This is Katie. She'll be joining us today with her classroom friends. Hi, everybody. It's nice to meet you. Hi, Katie. <laughs> Mrs. Tripp, some of our friends haven't been to school before, and I was wondering if you could show us the different spots of the classroom? Of course. Over here, there are hooks to hang your coat and store your things. We have a creative play center where you can pretend and play all sorts of things. There are spots with different toys, like building blocks, we also have a book nook where you can sit and read. This area is called our meeting area. We gather here to talk, sing, read books, all kinds of fun things. We use the tables in the classroom for writing and art. We also use them to eat our lunch and snacks throughout the day. Of course, we have a bathroom right here for when you need it. And we have an area outside that we can play on. We do lessons and have lots of playtime throughout the day and I'm here to help if you need anything. That's great. Well, what should we do first? Well, we're about to get started, so why don't you put your things away? Okay, good idea. Okay. Let's go. All right, friends, let's gather together in the meeting area. Okay. 
Good morning, friends. Let's sing our good morning song, okay? Okay. Good morning, good morning, good morning to you. Good morning, good morning, and how do you do? Your face is like sunshine. You bring joy to us. Good morning, good morning, and how do you do? How do you do on the count of three? One, two, three. How are you doing today? Good. Excellent. Oh, I see a lot of thumbs up there. Oh. Oh my. That's gonna be a lot of money. How much is all that? Uh, I'm to go Hey, Katie. How's your day going so far? <laughs> There's lots of fun things to play with. Um, but I'm wondering how I might try and make friends with some of the other kids here. Making friends can sometimes feel tricky. Here's an idea. Why don't you ask them a question? Like, what's your favorite game to play? And then you take a turn talking about things you like to do. And then when it comes time to play, you let them take a turn choosing what you do. Oh, so we all get a chance to pick something to do. That's right. Mm. And if you notice someone has a sad face, you could ask them what's wrong. A smile can really cheer someone up. Mm -hmm. Those are nice things we can all do to help make friends. Yeah, okay. Thanks, Mrs. Tripp. <laughs> Hi. Hi. What's your favorite color? Blue and gold. gold. Oh, pink, yeah, blue and gold. My favorite color is blue. Wow. What are you guys doing? Making a blue chain. You want to help us? Yeah, that'd, that'd be great. Okay. I can make a blue chain. All the blue ones? Yep. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. So far, it's so big. Wow. Mm -hmm. So far, so good. <laughs> <laughs> want to read it together? It's a nice picture. <laughs> Oh, Mrs. Tripp, can I go to the bathroom? Absolutely. It's just right over there. Okay. Do you need any help? No, I'll be okay. Thanks. Okay. <laughs> Butterfly, what do you notice this side versus this side? Is it different? Different. Or is it the? Same. Same. It is. It's really cool. It's an example of something called symmetry. All right, friends. It's time to pack up our things and go home. We had a whole day at school. Bye, Katie. Bye. See ya. <laughs> that was a lot of fun. I learned some new things and made some new friends. It was a good day. I'm glad you had a good day, Katie. Some days, things feel good. And some days, things might feel hard. Mm -hmm. And that's OK. School's a great place to learn about those things. And if you have a tricky feeling or things just don't go right, you can always ask your teacher for help. That's true. And thanks for all your help today, Mrs. Tripp. Oh, man, excuse me. <laughs> I'm feeling really tired all of a sudden. That can happen after school. Mm -hmm. Thanks for coming, everyone. <laughs> Bye. Bye, Mrs. Tripp.
Well, I hope seeing this classroom helps you feel all ready for when you go to school. Do you wanna hear something I like to do at the end of the day? I like to think of a great thing that happened. Hmm, oh, seeing all the books in the book nook. Yeah, there was some there that I'd never heard of before. What's something great that happened to you today? We can share those great things with someone when we go home. It's a nice thing to look forward to after school. Well, thanks for coming along with me today. And I hope whenever you go to school that you have a great time learning and playing with your friends. I'll see you next time. Bye.